while performing Madame Butterfly at the Greater Miami Opera through a newspaper interview, I announced this will be my last performance as an opera star. I choose from these days forward to glorify the name of my Savior, my Lord, Jesus Christ, through the singing of a sacred music. Yes, I had chosen in my heart to sing sacred music, but I knew no one in the sacred field and very little sacred music. What would I do after this last performance? My spirit was cast down. Then, about 15 minutes before curtain call, a blue envelope was slipped under my dressing room door. Miss Sung-Suk Lee, I would be honored if you would call me or have your agent call regarding the possibility of appearing on my show. With love in Christ, Diane Bish. Wow! He's a perfect timing! Even before my last opera began, he laid a new beginning before me which I didn't know or plan. It was his perfect timing. To God be the glory, great things he has done. So long he knew we that he gave us his son. Who yielded his life on atonement for sin. And opened the life gate that all may go in. Praise the Lord, praise the Lord, let the earth hear his voice. Praise the Lord, praise the Lord, let the people rejoice. Oh, come to the Father through Jesus the Son, and give him the glory, great things he has done. Oh, perfect redemption, the purchase of blood, to every believer, the promise of God, the vilest offender who truly obey, that moment may enter the heavenly way. Praise the Lord, let the earth hear his voice, praise the Lord. Today on The Joy of Music, we have brought you excerpts from a new musical drama on the life of Sung Suk Lee, soprano, an artist who has found the true joy of music and joy of living. Thank you for joining us, and we look forward to seeing you again next week on The Joy of Music. <laughs>